This weekend, many of you reported to me that a malware alert was appearing on your Huawei devices in the Google application. At first, I thought there were few users, but little by little, after posting it on my X account, more users started reporting the exact same thing to me. To start, it must be clarified that Huawei in its optimizer app integrates antivirus in collaboration with Avast. This antivirus is in charge of conducting regular scans to detect any malware, and that is the reason why many of you have begun to send me these screenshots in which a threat called Trojan SMSPA is supposedly detected within Google. It is classified as a high level of danger, and in the details it reads as follows. It was detected that this application sent SMS privately, persuaded users to pay with adult content, downloaded or installed applications privately, or stole private information which can cause property damage and privacy leaks. We recommend uninstalling it immediately. However, it not only happened on Huawei devices, but also on Honor devices. The interesting part is that this occurred on Huawei devices still compatible with Google services. That is to say, this application had not been installed from unknown sources or anything, but directly from the Google Play Store. The curious thing is that it also happened on Honor devices that are already out of Huawei's coverage. That is to say, models like Magic 5 Lite also detected this inconvenience, but at the time of recording this video, neither Huawei nor Honor have given an official statement. Personally, I have asked these companies to tell me what is happening. So, as soon as I get a response, I will let you know, either through a video or through my X account. So please, follow me there. For now, from sites like Huawei Central, based on reports from different users on Reddit, they have simply proposed a solution, which is to clear the cache of the Huawei Optimizer application. With this, the alert stops appearing, although it will probably reappear after some time when the database is updated or something similar. So, for now, we will continue waiting for the official positions and see if they propose any solution or if any update is released or see what happens.